I'm Gabriel Almodovar, makeup artist with Maybelline New York. Experimenting with liners is the best way to start playing with trends. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get four great graphic liner looks. So let's get right into the look with iStudio Lasting Drama Gel Eyeliner. What's so great about this is that it comes in a variety of colors and packaged with its own little brush to really give you that bold eyeliner look. Make that liner really thick towards the outside corner and lift it up on the edge. The trick is to really make sure that once you have the line that you want, to make sure that it dries down fully before you open your eye. And then that way the color won't transfer from your eye line to your eyelid. So the next eyeliner look is using iStudio Master Drama Cream Pencil. And what's so fantastic about this pencil in Vibrant Violet is that it is essentially a gel eyeliner, but in a pencil form. So it's gonna give you the smoothest line in application. Now the pencil's gonna give you a very intense color because it's highly concentrated pigments, which is why when you see this purple from the Vibrant Violet, it's really a true violet. Our next eyeliner look is with iStudio Master Precise Ink Pen in black. And what's so great about this is that its really fine point is gonna give you super precise lines. This pen also never dries and never skips. The felt tip of this pen really allows the liquid liner to glide on so easily. So the next look, we're gonna be using iStudio Master Duo Liquid Liner. So you wanna make sure when you grab the product that you shake it first to saturate the entire tip with product. And then of course, be aware of where the tip is. It's a flat applicator, so it's gonna give you a thin line when you apply it one way, and if you turn it the other way, it's gonna be thick. So I'm gonna start on the inside corner, and as I pull this out, I'm turning my wrist, and then turning it back to get to that fine point. So what makes Master Duo so different is that it has a super glossy finish, which makes that line pop even more. So to have even more fun with this look and to make it much more bold and more graphic, I'm actually gonna take Master Duo and carve a line out in the crease of the eye. So I like to start at the center because it really just kind of gives me an idea of where the shape is going to be created. And then you can more easily guide the curvature that you are drawing. There you have it, from big and bold to slim and sexy. Now you have a liner look for every mood. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.